My name is John Maher, uh, AKA Petaluma Pete, and I play the piano on the street, and I have been here in Petaluma, California for the past 13 years, um, and I do it for the love of making music uh, and also to promote making music in the music schools and to help the nonprofits in town. And having landed in such a beautiful place as downtown Petaluma, I wanted to do something to pay back. We are currently sitting at the Petaluma Arts Center, and there are 45 pianos that have been painted by artists. And uh, over the years, for 10 years or so, I would get old pianos off of Craigslist and give them to an artist, and they would paint them and decorate them, and we'd put them on the street for people to play. And when COVID hit, I thought, you know what? I don't want people sharing keyboards. So I started the process of picking up all these pianos and taking them to a warehouse. And when I was standing in the middle of all these pianos, I thought, wouldn't this make an exhibit? And it's called The Pianos of Petaluma. Now, the typical experience of playing piano on the street is uh, watching the people's faces. Uh, making the children dance is also just such a rush. Um, and also uh, the tips, I love the tips. People like him, they like hearing his music, they like his upbeat nature, and so when he talks about an issue or talks about a project, people listen and they learn and they get involved. So the connection between Petaluma Pete and the trestle is that uh, Petaluma Pete was made a certified tourism ambassador not long ago, something you have to take a test for. And that credibility is now being used to transfer information to the public about the need for the renovation of the trestle. It's historical, it's been around for a long time, it's something that's needed fixing. So the trestle now is rotting. Uh, and there's a plan to fix it. And all we really need to do is uh, get it together and turn it into this wonderful big front porch for the downtown area. I think the Spirit Award is perfect for John. He gives to our community and in endless ways. His commitment and his tenacity and uh, his ideas for this community have benefited us in so many ways. His work on the trestle is outstanding and he brings us together and makes us smile. So I can't think of a better person to be getting this award. He is just such a nice guy. You know, he is always out there trying to work on things that promote the community. What I would hope would happen out of this recognition is that uh, those who watch it uh, can come to the realization that they also can make a difference. It's in your head, it's in your heart. And the more you help, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the more the community grows. So, you know, next time you think about complaining about something, instead, volunteer and do something about it.